Welcome to Morning Manor with Pastor Steve Mary. Today's topic, your reward. Your labor is not in vain. 1 Corinthians 15, 58. It's easy to forget that this world is not your home. You're going to spend eternity with Christ in a place prepared especially for you. St. John 14. You will also be rewarded for the job you've done. The Bible not only supports this idea, it spells out some specifics. Here are three you need to know about today. 1. Most of your reward will be received in heaven, not on earth. There are earthly rewards and we can see Mark 10.30. But God reserves special honors for the day when each man's work will become evident and he will receive a reward. 1 Corinthians 3, 13 to 14. Your service now will determine your status then. 2. Your reward will be based on quality, not quantity. We are impressed by size, volume, noise, and numbers, but God has his eyes on motive. His reward are based on what you do with what you have and the heart you put into it. He's an equal opportunity employer when it comes to rewards. And three, your reward may be postponed, but it will never be forgotten. When you've done what was required, yet you are ignored and misunderstood, remember, your labor is not in vain. When you've done the right thing and receive neither credit nor acknowledgement, remember your labor is not in vain. When you've served, given, sacrificed, and willingly step aside in order for God to get all the glory, remember your labor is not in vain. The thought for today, what an assurance. God bless you today. In Jesus' name.